Sapping people back in the kitchen again. Today is the day that I'm going to use this Chef Free AFG01 air fryer grill for the first time. I am going to use the barbecue griddle grill feature of it, whatever you want to call it. And I'm going to be you cooking these seasoned chicken skewers from the My Protein range. So a bit of a mix up from the My Protein, the normal stuff, because um, yeah, I thought this would be a decent way to cook it and maybe sear the edges, sear that chicken a bit and make it a bit nice. So we have got this, um, it's like griddle plate that goes in it. It's got a couple of handles there so you can pull it in and out. And uh, yeah, so it should be, it should give it a nice, a nice sear inside this uh, air fryer. Like it's not been turned on yet. I've never put it on. So I am just going to sit that in there. Well, I'm not sure I'll sit that on the side. We'll just, we'll just uh, take a closer look at this air fryer, the griddle, and then we'll, um, we'll get into these chicken skewers. Come on. So this is the uh, new air fryer grill I've got. There is a few settings there. You've got fries, beef, bake, air fry, roast, and air broil. So I'm not sure what we cook it on. Air grill, you've got four different, there you go, we'll, we'll do it on that. Air grill and four different heat temperatures, which is, um, I think we'll probably just put it on a medium and see how it goes. And so you've got this inside, this inside base here which obviously goes in first, like a roasting tin. Then you put your chicken skewers onto this griddle tray and sit that in there like that. And then we'll get the chicken on there and then it'll get a bit of a, well, it should be nice and griddled and the, obviously the, the air comes from the top there with the fan and the heating element in there. And it just shuts nicely. And we'll go for it from there. So let's take a look at these seasoned chicken skewers now. Okay, so this is what we are going to be cooking in the uh, Chefry Air Fryer Grill for the first time. My protein seasoned chicken skewers. 520 grams for four chicken skewers. They look like beasts of chicken skewers. I'm not going to be cooking it with anything else. There's going to be no rice and salad on my plate. Maybe I might marinate a couple halfway through. We'll see. 30 grams of protein, low fat, 149 calories, and I think that that is per skewer. So if you had all four of these, you'd have a good 600 calorie meal and 120 grams of protein. So there they are. They look all right, but are they going to be plain? They did have um, salt and pepper ones, but they were out of stock when I bought these. So not sure about that. So the ingredients there. Chicken breast fillet, potato starch, xylose, salt, fully refined soya bean oil, acidity regulator, sodium carbonate. Made with 100 grams of raw chicken breast fillet, fillet per 100 grams of finished product. So it's just chicken breast. This one does not say about the low sodium diet. And actually, it does give us the origin of chicken as China. Seasoned chicken skewers, cooked boneless chicken breast fillet, seasoned in brine, threaded onto bamboo skewers. So, that is the full nutritional information for you guys that know what you're talking about there. I, of course, do not. It does say may contain egg and soya. Ways to cook. Now, this is why I'm trying these in this new air fryer grill. Because you can oven from frozen, of course, and it does say for best results cooked from frozen. However, what I'm seeing here is barbecue from defrost. Cook on the barbecue, turning frequently until thoroughly cooked and juices run clear. So, this is effectively an indoor barbecue grill. So that's exactly what we're going to do. So, let's get into these now. So, there they are, on the griddle pan. So let's turn this on now and get cooking. So I think what we're going to do is I'm going to just press this air grill and I'm going to go for the second one. Air grill. Oh, the third one is the automatic one. So let's start, let's stick with that one. So it, it wants me to do it for 240 degrees for 15 minutes. Air grill. So I think that's what we're going to go for. So I'll shut the top. And I'll press start. 
pre so that must be preheating so I'll bring you back when something changes so as you can hear it's uh, it's got a bit of a, a whirring sound but it is still preheating there so I don't know if that's going to continue all the way through the, the air um, the air grill but we'll see it's a little bit louder than the tower one that I've got there but that doesn't preheat that just like an oven so maybe this is just maybe it's just the air grill that preheats maybe if you're air frying or roasting it doesn't we'll see but just going to stick with the, the settings for the air grill and give it a go and see what happens I'll see how long this has been I'll time this preheat and then see what happens I'll bring you back when something changes so after six and a half minutes it's changed to add I'm guessing that that means add the food but I've already put the food in there so I'm just going to open and close it and see if that actually does anything okay so we are away so I I left the food in there but um, it'll be fine this is now on for 15 minutes at 240 so I've just had a little check on them there's still nine minutes remaining there so I've only been on this 240 for six minutes and they're pretty much done on the outside I'm hoping that they are cooked through. I did defrost them and on the, on, on the ways to cook it does say cook on the barbecue, turn it frequently until they're cooked and the juices run clear. So I'm hoping that because they're defrosted and because they are getting grilled at such a high temperature they are cooked through. So I'm going to just take one out, I'm just going to stop it a minute. But I'm going to give it another minute but I'm going to stop it and then take one out and see if it's cooked through let's have a look at these so I've just hit the cancel button it's gone off just wait for the fan to, to stop because I don't want it to be bashing about you see that look at that this is warm look at them wow I'm going to have to try find some tongs to pick these up I'm not touching any metal it's just this so there it is it's got to be cooked through sure look at that wow I'm just going to cut one open a little bit and have a give it a check so I have just cut it open and the meat well it looks cooked through it's nice fibrous white chicken meat there so, I think it's time for a taste, don't you? I'm going to marinate a couple of these in barbecue sauce for my girls. Wow, tell you what, they do look fantastic. Now, I know that I could just leave it like that, but I'm actually going to put it back on the air grill for a couple of minutes. Hopefully it doesn't need to preheat again. I'm just going to try cook that barbecue into it. Probably should have done this from the start, to be fair. But, you know what, I was just experimenting. First time I've ever used this thing. Although, I have to say, looking at it, I'm impressed. I know that I've lost all the... Uh, healthiness of the chicken skewer on these on these ones now from the my protein but I'm not bothered so they're gonna go back in now I'm gonna put them back in and I'm gonna just air grill we'll have a taste of this normal one look at that it's like it's been done on the barbecue all important taste time look at that chicken in there I know it's from China but it looks I mean look at that so I'm gonna give this a go just plain the barbecue ones do look good I'll be honest but oh wow hmm Oh my god.
Wow, wow, wow. So soft and succulent, perfectly cooked, gnarly on the outside, crispy, proper, like barbecued. Even a little bit smoky, to be honest. Look at that. Now, I know this chicken is from China, but it's soft, it's delicious, it's succulent. Oh. Real chicken breast. Of course, you can buy these bamboo skewers and make this yourself, and I probably will, fresh in this thing. This is absolutely fantastic. Can't wait to get a steak in there, some burgers. Wow. I'm going to be having a barbecue in February. Mm. Absolutely out of this world. Now, these, I think they're about four and a half quid for four. Definitely can make them yourself out of some out of some chicken breasts and get a lot more than that but it's more about I know it's my protein product but it is more about this Chefri air grill now this is the first time I've used this air grill and I am massively impressed the, I'm, I'm guessing my girls are gonna absolutely love these barbecue barbecue ones because that is fantastic Wow it's just perfect it's cooked them perfectly in about 10 minutes because I, I, I you're not supposed to put them in with the preheat but I did anyway they were defrosted so it only took actually about six minutes after it said add you live and learn I'll, I'll try them again well I'll try fresh ones when it says add but you know what save yourself some time put them in when it's preheating it's preheating anyway put it in there for the six minutes it preheats and then you only need to cook them six minutes it like cooks them slowly when it's preheating so all right, this. Wow, look at that. juicy. Mm. Really good, then. I know that some other reviewers have actually reviewed them. I'm can't, I, I, don't, I don't think I've seen one, anybody do it yet. But I, so I don't know their opinions, but I'm very impressed with this. But I'm guessing that they would have cooked theirs in there either the normal air fryer or their oven. But let me tell you, when when a chicken skewer comes out looking like that, wow, that is phenomenal. I mean, obviously barbecue is the way to cook this sort of stuff. But if you want it in in, in February, maybe one of these is a, the way to go. So a big shout out to. Old Senate UK, who are the, 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 the people that make this, who was gifted me this. There will be a link in the description um, and a discount code if he's emailed me back. Hopefully, but I think I know it was already discounted on Amazon, so I'll put the Amazon link in there. Amazon Prime, next day delivery. These are. See, so just said add them, but obviously I'd already put it in again. So it preheated, it didn't take. Well, I'm going to be talking, it didn't take as long that time to preheat. So it just it must have a temperature gauge in there gets up to temperature and then tells you to add your food so I think I'd still do it the same way because that is they're fantastic but that is an overwhelming success the chicken skewers probably overpriced for what they are but cooked in this chef free AFG01 absolutely fantastic I'm just going to leave you with a little vision of these barbecue ones coming out and I'll catch you tomorrow I'm going to make some uh, I'm going to give it a wash out so I won't do a video on that <laughs> But um, I'll give it a wash out, give it a clean, and then it also comes with like a, a roasting a chip pan thing. So I'm gonna make some homemade chips and give them a go and try cook them in there and see how that turns out. Because there is a fries section there, and then I'm probably gonna go buy myself, go buy myself a steak and try that beef section. So thank you for watching, and uh, I'll catch you tomorrow for some homemade chips in this new chef free. AFGO1 air fry grill. See you then. Did somebody say just What's happening people? Back in the kitchen again. Hope you're all fantastic. Would be
special. Just wouldn't buy that again.